back guys to another video so this one is the Bryson and it's an awkward home so let's go in to see what this one looks like okay so this is the entryway and I love these wall decor The entryway table is so great. <laughs> Love this table. So let's go in. Okay guys, so this could be like a dining space. Or it could also be like, a, uh, like an office. But this is what they used it as. Uh, yeah, as an office as well. Uh, as a sitting area too. Look at these curtains. Sorry guys, the light is awful. It's beautiful in person because the light is so bright. And look, look at this beautiful, oh my God, I love this. It's so farmhouse chic, I love it. So, let's go into the house itself okay so the style of this home is very farm house chic like i said in the beginning and i'm here for it i love the brightness the grays the cream i love that right now i cannot do cream in my downstairs but i have lots of cream in my upstairs because of my kids um, they're not very uh, careful when it comes to, you know, their kids anyways. <laughs> but I love this. Don't you love what that looks like? It's so beautiful, guys. So look at these big windows. The wow factor is the kitchen. Look at this view. Isn't it this so beautiful? Look on the wall. I love this basket, so pretty. So when we come close for you to see the table and the chairs and the bench, it's so beautiful and I love the floor as well. And I'm changing everything in my home um, to, you know, floor that are like these instead of um, carpet. So. I'm gonna definitely show you guys a tour of that as well. But, and also I'm changing my painted light. I'm telling you when I come to model homes, it inspires me to change my things around. Um, but I taking it day at a time, but look at this kitchen, so beautiful. So I love the greenery, so pretty. I can't wait for the stores to be open so I can go by and see if I can find things like this. And I love the tray, it's like a little vignette. And um, these are so beautiful. So this house is very farmhouse chic. Let's see what else it has to offer. Sorry guys, my voice is low because this is a matter home. Lots of people come in and go out. I'm not the only person here. Don't want to be shouting around. I think that's the garage. Yes, a three car garage back there. And this is where we were previously. How beautiful is this? So this is where we came from previously, and let's go upstairs. As we're going upstairs, you find this huge, this huge wall. <gasps> look at this beautiful, sh look, look at this light, guys. Like, look at this. Isn't this beautiful? So this is where we were previously. Let's go up really quick without making you guys dizzy. So when you come upstairs, it's another like, living room which you can use more like a sitting area but they have a tv on the wall and i love the way that looks right don't you love that i'm not a fan too much of this color it's more like a study place for kids it's like basically a place where a whole family can gather and i think this is a master and i love 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 that guys oh my god I wish I had enough space in my bedroom to put something like this. Um, but 
you know what? That's fine. <laughs> um, it's a huge bedroom, guys. Okay, look at this mirror. See, I'm telling you, you don't need to put a lot of stuff in your home for it to be beautiful. Just the simplistic, just clutter-free, minimal look. It's just so beautiful. And there is a bathroom over here. And I love the way this bathroom. And this bathroom has the same cabinet as the kitchen cabinet. So here I is. Here I is. And they have this huge shower. I think you can fit at least a couple of, yeah, a lot of people in there. And the master, um, the master closet. And it's huge, it's very big, it's bigger than mine. It's smaller in other people's home, but it's bigger than mine. So this is the master bedroom. Now let's take you guys to other spaces that they have. So when you come straight down the hall, there is the laundry room, simple, but very huge. Also, there is another full bathroom here, I think for the kids or for anybody else, really. So we have this bedroom, I think it's a teenager or a, like a twin bedroom this is decorated very cute yeah it's for a kid don't you see the customers on the wall and it has a closet i'm loving these um drapes you know anything better than all white all the time you uh what does it say love you most it's so cute look at look at this bedroom guys listen I am in love and look at the rug. I hope this is inspiring people. Guys, you don't need to pack a lot of things in your kid's room for it to be cute. That's why I keep my kid's room so clutter free, so simple, and I love it. And these places inspire me to do that. 